I'm about to finish my first 5 a.m. run in forever. And before I went outside and put my shoes on, I had many excuses such as, oh, it would be more beneficial if I sleep one more hour. Oh, but my shoes have holes in them. Oh, but yo, I have allergies. And in the morning, they're the worst. I may sneeze a couple times. Old excuses, excuses after excuses. And this is kind of a message to my younger self because he was the same. He was fucking the same. Like, oh, but I don't know what to eat in the morning. So let me grab Nutella. Let me grab 100 grams of sugar right, right in the morning. Oh, I can't run, it's too cold. I will, I will be sick for a week, then I will miss my exams. All those excuses. And even now that I'm somewhat disciplined, that voice is still telling me, no, don't do it. Like, here's another excuse, another excuse. And I notice that that voice is a little bitch. But I also notice that if I do go on a run, why run? Great question, because it's the one thing that I don't want to fucking do. I hate running. I, I, I honestly hate running. But I know that after every single run, I feel better. I feel energized. I feel ready to conquer the day. That's why I went on, on a run at 5 a.m. when everybody's sleeping. That's why I went now, before my 9 to 5 job. That one hour extra sleep, doesn't mean shit. So a message is basically to my younger self that you can do it if you avoid that little bitch noise. And what I always tell myself now, if you can run, slow down. If you can keep up the pace, slow down. Just don't stop. That's why at the end of the every video, I say, keep working hard and I'm proud of you. And same thing now, keep working hard and I'm proud of you.